I have five colors in my work. The yellow is in the center. I mean, if you have to come up with a color that represents me, people would say yellow. Yellow is my color. The yellow and the black is the strongest combination that you could come up with. They're made to be seen from a great distance. It's interesting in the context of this site because the glass is green and there's a green box in the middle of this big, big room. The room itself is extreme. I've never been in a room like this with this glass cube in the center. And then you have trees growing in the glass, like, 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 like you know, trees growing in the back of the glass tube. And then where, how do you even look at my work from across the hall? I mean, how do you do it? It becomes a very intimate thing when you're next to it. I built this project uh, two stories high. Um, so it's one over the other, but there's a balcony in between. So one could follow images straight through it, or you can be on individual floors and see the information. But it's not dependent on understanding the entire thing. A big part of it has to do with the, the senses. Eyes, ears, nose, mouth feeling uh, very much about that. So it's how we see, how we hear, how we smell, how we taste, how the world, how we understand where we are, how we are in the world. And so signs are evident in this big project. The whole thing is rubbing. Uh, this is the first form of reproducible media. It's old, 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 old. It's primal, it's so old and I discovered it in the early 80s uh, myself and have used it since. The piece, I don't want it to be like too crazy, like look at me. I want it to disappear. 